Yeah, I have bought Skullsay in mini PC. This is how I have received the box. The box looks pretty good. But got slightly damaged by transit, maybe. Transit. This is how it looks. The packaging is good. The box is really cool. So you can see that the model is N50 16GB512. So let's open it. And this is how it looks. Mini PC. It looks similar to Mini Cooper. Okay. So I'm going to open it. And do you have a and you have a casing like this? Yeah, flip cover. And inside you have the mini PC, this is the mini PC then you have the booklet and this is a stand actually it is a stand for holding this mini PC it's a magnetic stand, I'll show you how you can place that and the box include an adapter hopefully an adapter Yeah, adapter and uh, data cable. That's all. Okay. So I'm going to open the cover. It, this is how it looks. Skull Saints. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. looks pretty cool it's actually very small here you have the display now I'm just going to open the cover and check the configuration so there is a latch here just pull it it's actually a magnetic one simply you can open it and you can see here that it is M dot NVMe and which is 512 GB and the RAM is of 16 GB DDR4 all the configuration is correct as per mentioned and you can leave it back it's a magnetic cover actually it is not a metal casing but it is actually a plastic casing which is very good which is having high quality and this is how you place it in the table. Yeah, this is how. Okay, now I will plug it and I will show the performance after that. After unboxing, I have connected my new Skull Saint Mini PC to all my existing peripherals and now I'll show you how it starts and how it performed I already configured it with my existing system so this is how it looks I'm going to start it you just press the start button power button I can see that the illumination light blinks on and it starts connected to my two monitors simultaneously we can connect it to two monitors that is two HD monitors and you can configure it in Windows 11 itself how you want it to be I have connected vertically and the other one horizontally it has already started it doesn't take too much of time it performs good when compared it with my Dell laptop this is actually 11th generation laptop which I was being using
this is the display feature now you can change the display when you load this mini pc you have a software inside it which you can use for customizing this you can see that it changed this is the app based on the customization it will appear here so just change to the display I can see here it has been changed to the one which you have inputted now regarding the configuration I'll share this screen Just go to the settings. Performance is very good. I have tried multiple applications. I have installed the uh, Photoshop. I installed the uh, Chrome. Three browsers additionally. And I have been using uh, the screen recorder. Obvious Studio. And a few other applications. All, all running at the same time. And it's performing good. So it comes with the uh, Windows. 11 latest version and you can go and update to currently this is windows 11 2 for us 2 as you can see it here if we go to the task manager let's see the configuration you can see it here the CPU usage is very limited, that is, it's taking only 7% currently. Now you can see that it has got a 16 GB of memory and you can upgrade it to up to 32 GB. And the hard disk capacity is of 512 SSD and you can upgrade it to 8 TB. And it has got a maximum speed of 3.7 GHz. That's the processing speed. 4 thread and 4 core. See, so I have opened multiple applications and still it's performing very good. Still, it is taking only 46% of CPU and it is still running the clock speed is 1.88 GHz, which can go up to 3.6 GHz. So, with the first impression, it is quite good. So, with the first impression, this is quite good. I am impressed with uh, this skull sync. And I tell you, in my opinion, who all will be benefited from this uh, uh, mini PC? Actually, if you are not a core developer or a core gamer, then it's for you. You can uh, use it in your office purpose as well as for your home use. And uh, you can have multiple applications running it, including the Photoshop, Corel Draw, and all editing tools. It will easily run without any problem. You can have the Linux platform installed in it. The only issue is that this particular display doesn't support Linux OS. So you don't have an interface or a UI to change this display setting customized. So this is N150, the latest mini PC from Skullsane. So I hope this uh, video is useful for you. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like and share. Thank you.